So this is my inner thigh workout. So when my glutes are sore, I am still able to go to the gym or to do a house workout or a vacation workout. And this is one of my favorites. So you're going to need a, uh, first of all, your booty bands, um, next your sliders, and then also a, uh, a ball. Um, so any of these items, you'll be able to actually click on the link. So go ahead and just read below and you'll be able to find where you can get all these items. So again, all of these exercises that I'm demonstrating are all in inner thigh. So we're gonna sculpt that area for you. Um, we're gonna start with the sliders first. So I'm gonna go into standing, seating, and then lying down. It's kind of how I made the workout today. Um, I also made it as a pyramid routine. So when I say pyramid, think about the reps that I'm doing and how that's creating a pyramid, okay? So the first one I'm gonna do is one, and then come back up, and I'm using my inner thigh to actually pull me back up. So again, I'm gonna come down into a seated position, like I'm acting like I'm sitting back in a chair with my chest up. Notice that my toes, my knees, and my hip are all in alignment right here, and then I'm coming up and I'm squeezing. So now that one's gonna be two reps. After that, we're gonna go to three. After three, let's go four. To make it a little bit more challenging, really push into this slider and, and uh, let the resistance make it a little more difficult. Last one is five. Beautiful, and then I'm gonna switch to the other side. Now, the back side of the pyramid. Switch to the other leg, and I'm going to start with five. Now the other side, starting with five. I love that one, it's my favorite. So my next one, you're gonna grab your yoga ball. Um, I always start behind the ball first. <laughs> a lot of girls um, have kind of an uncomfortable getting into this position, so please, please watch this as I do this. Um, you're gonna have the ball in front of you, as so you're gonna go ahead and just kind of grip onto the ball with your inner thighs and then lean forward. That leaning forward is gonna draw a straight line from your body to your hip to your knee. And then behind you, you're just gonna be on your tippy toes and you're not using your ankles or your toes in this at all. It's all through your inner thighs. So focus on your knees coming in and squeezing. So now here's a faster motion of that. So keeping your core tight, we're gonna go ahead and start. You're gonna squeeze with everything all you've got. If you can try to pop that ball with that one, that's perfect. Pop that ball, whew. You got some strong inner thighs, girl. So that's one, let's go ahead and go into two. Good, three, keeping the core tight. Good, four. Give it all you got. Those nice little squeezes are everything. You're gonna really feel this one, girls. I love it. And the last one, just get it a good, nice hold and squeeze there, take a little breather. And now we're gonna go from five down to one. Definitely feel that one. That one also is my, one of my top favorites too. Love it. So your last workout for your inner thighs, you're using your booty band and I like to play it, place it on my ankles. Um, and <clears throat> if you want a little bit more advanced, you can ask, actually place a weight on your inner thighs. So 
how to do this one, your top leg is going to be the one that's planted down, while your bottom leg is going to be the one doing the work. You want to make sure that your hips are stacked so they're not getting misaligned through the workout. So please pay attention to that. So we're going to go ahead and start first with the top leg in front, and we're going to go for a total of one. After that, two. Notice I'm kind of pulsing up at the top. Four. Five. And hold. After that, we're going to start again with five, but now we're going to move our, our, front, our top leg to the back. And five. Next, four. Three. Two. One. Awesome. We're going to go ahead and switch sides now. And one. Two. Three. Five. And hold. Good. Switch sides. And five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Awesome girls. Go ahead and try that workout for inner thighs. If you'd like a little bit more advanced, you can take your pyramid number higher as well. I would like to do that three times. Are you up for the challenge on it? So follow the Booty Band Brigade and all of this fun exercises and information that we're just so excited to share with you. Um, so you're gonna find us on social media, on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, Booty Bands Official. As well, you're gonna find your booty band on the link below.